Are your reps wasting time pursuing leads that are already active opportunities or existing customers? Accurate lead to account matching is critical if you want to efficiently convert leads from your website, events, webinars, email campaigns, and more. But it's impossible to stay on top of manually and complex to manage across different solutions. In this video, we'll show you how easy it is to set up lead to account matching across all of your Chili Piper products. It all happens on your matching page which is intuitively designed to walk you through the flow of creating your lead to account matching logic. We'll start with our default lead to account matching algorithm. This allows you to match incoming leads based on a matching domain and extension. You can decide whether to look at contact emails, the account's web address, or both. This default logic is simple to set up and covers most use cases like when you're looking to match webinar leads only through their professional email address. For more complex use cases, like matching based on phone number or account name, we now also leverage the power of Salesforce duplicate rules to find more potential matches. This added capability also supports fuzzy matching. So, for example, you can match event leads from Nike with your account named Nike Inc. Our fuzzy capabilities also support acronym matching. So for example, a lead with the company name IBM can match an account named International Business Machines. Clicking the Add Salesforce duplicate rule will display the active deduplication rules you have in Salesforce. You just need to select the rules you want to include in your matching algorithm and easily adjust their priority if needed. The combined results from these two algorithms, Chili Piper and Salesforce, will capture all matching accounts, offering you the best of both worlds. But how do you handle situations with multiple multiple matches. If a prospect matches with multiple accounts, we'll use filtering and tiebreakers to get the best result. Let's start by looking at the two types of filters you can create. The first are account filters that include or exclude potential matches based on account field values. The second are account and lead comparison filters that allow you to include or exclude potential matches based on how field values compare to each other. For example, suppose that John Doe at Acme.com matches multiple Acme accounts in your Salesforce instance. We can use filters to only include matches with the customer field marked as true and no sign of the word test in their account name. Or we can also use the comparison filter to check if the account's phone field is equal to John Doe's phone field. If after checking filters, there is still more than one possible account match, tiebreakers can be used to prioritize even further and find which account should be selected. In this example, I'm prioritizing the account that was created most recently, but you can combine unlimited fields and reorder their position to change their priority. As you can see, tiebreakers include both standard and smart field options. So you can create a rule to look for accounts with the most recent last modified date or use a smart field that looks for accounts with the most opportunities. And that covers our new lead to account matching capabilities in Chili Piper. Simple, easy to configure rules that you can use across all of our products to ensure that leads from every channel are going to the right accounts. That's less time wasted for your sales team and more time spent converting new leads. To learn more, go to chilipiper.com.